guys in this video we are going to learn how to write algorithm to find given number prime number or not here we have to find given number prime number or not prime number is a positive integer which is divisible by 1 and itself okay it means it will give reminder 0 only it is divisible by 1 and itself write algorithm algorithm is a step by step process to solve a problem step 1 Algorithm is always start with start statement. So initially we have to write start statement. In step 2 we have to read input variable. Here we have to find given number prime number or not. So here we have to read a number that is read n. In step 3 we have to declare flag value. Declare f is equal to 0. Initial it is, is equal to 0. Flag means it is a in programming language flag is used to store a boolean value that is 0 or 1 or true or false like that. In step 4 we know that 1 is not a prime number because it is divisible by only one only one number that is 1 right. So if n is equal to 1 then we have to print n is not a prime number 1 is not a prime number we know that right so here we have to print n is not prime number then we have to go to stop statement right so here we have to print go go to step it will write later okay steps for step number 5 we know that 2 is smallest prime number n is equal to 2 we know that 2 is the smallest prime prime number then if n is equal to 2 we have to print n is prime number right n is prime number 2 is divisible by 1 and itself right 2 in step sorry here also after completing this process we have to directly go to stop statement right so you have to write to go to step we will write later after completing algorithm step number six here we using for loop for i value initially i is equal to two two it will repeat until i value become n minus one okay for i is equal to two to n minus one if n remainder of n if it is divisible by i the remainder is equal to 0 i value a n sorry n value is completely divisible by i value then we have to set f is equal to 1 initially flag f is equal to 0 right here here we declared f is equal to 0 if n value that is our number is completely divisible by i value then we have to set f is equal to 1 it means it is a it is not a prime number else if this condition is false we have to go to step 6 we have to go to six. 6 if n is completely divisible by then we have to set f is equal to 1 after that we have to break this loop means we have to break for loop right it means it will come out of the loop if f is equal to 1 here we got it given number is not a prime number so we will directly print no given number is not a prime number Step number 7, if f is equal to 1, then if f is equal to 1, it means we know that given number is not a prime number, right? Here if n is completely divisible by 1, it is equal to, if completely divisible by i, then we will set t of is equal to 1. It means it become, it become not a prime number, right? If here this condition, if n f is equal to 1, it means then we have to print n is not a 
prime number else we have to print n is prime number in step 8 we have to stop the algorithm using stop statement here we have to write stop statement here we got it step 8 is going to stop the algorithm so here we have to write in step 4 we have to write here go to step 8 and here step 5 also here we have to complete go to step number 8 okay so this is the algorithm to find given number prime number or not initially step 1 start statement step 2 we have to read n value in step 3 we have to declare f that is flag f is equal to 0 in step 4 we know that 1 is not a prime number right if n is equal to 1 then we have to print n is not a prime number next if this condition is true we have to go to step number 8 that is stop statement directly we will stop the algorithm in step number 5 5 we know that 2 is the smallest prime number if n is equal to 2 then we have to print n is prime number right then we have to stop the algorithm using stop statement that time you have to directly go to step step number 8 go to step 8 next in step 6 we have to use for loop for i is equal to 2 to n minus 1 it will execute the loop until i become n minus 1 if n is we have to find reminder of n percentage i that is equal to 0 then we have to set f is equal to 1 initially f is equal to 0 right next we have to set f is equal to 1 and we have to break this loop if this condition is true else we have to repeat go to step 6 if f is if f is equal to 1 if f is equal to 1 then we have to print n is not a prime number else we have to print n is prime number in step 8 stop statement here consider if i n value is equal to 4 if our given number is 4 here we will find a percentage of 2 that is if reminder of 2 4 percentage 2 is equal to 0 it will set f is equal to 1 and break this statement if n is equal to 5 if n percentage of 2 is equal to it is not equal to 0 right 5 percentage 2 is equal to 1 right the remainder of this condition is equal to 1 right it will not become true then it will go to step number 6 it will file statement right it is going to step number 8 here i become 3 that time i percentage of 3 here remainder of this is 2 right here this condition is not true right it become 2 again it will go to step number 6 this is the algorithm to find a given number prime number or not thank you for watching please like and subscribe to my channel